This muscle in our body can reduce blood sugar by about 52%. And the beautiful thing about this muscle is that you can activate it even while sitting. I will explain how to do that in just a moment. The soleus muscle is one of the most unique muscles in the body. Unlike other muscles, it works almost non-stop. It's working when we stand, when we walk, and even when we sit. But what's truly special about this muscle is its composition. About 80% of this muscle is made of special type of muscle fiber called red muscle fibers. These muscle fibers are full of mitochondria. In simple terms, mitochondria are like tiny power plants in our cells. They take sugar and oxygen and produce energy for the muscle. This is the reason we human need food and we need oxygen to live. Thanks to this unique composition, the soleus muscle is able to absorb large amount of sugar, glucose from the blood and convert it into energy with great efficiency. Why is this important? When we eat a meal rich in carbohydrate like bread, rice, pasta, potatoes or something sweet, our blood sugar level rises. This is what known as sugar spike. This blood sugar spike creates problems they cause inflammation in the body they damage our blood vessels and they make our body release a lot of insulin and after the sugar level drop we feel tired we feel hungry and crave something sweet again and it's a cycle that hard to break this is where the soleus muscle comes in because this muscle in our leg has more mitochondria than most other muscles in the body. It can burn large amount of glucose from the blood with exceptional efficiency. In a study conducted at the University of Houston, it was found that when people did a simple exercise of soleus push-ups, which are simply heel raises, they were able to reduce the post-meal blood sugar spike by about 52% and that is very significant. Another improvement was related to insulin. They also managed to lower insulin levels by about 60%. This means the body doesn't need to release as much insulin to deal with all this sugar. In this study, they tracked the exercise for 5 hours, but you don't need to do the exercise for 5 hours, not at all. Even 10 to 15 minutes can make a significant difference. And you can also break it up throughout the day. For example, every time you sit, you can do this exercise and it's add up over the day. So how do you do this exercise? It's very simple. You sit on a chair, place your feet flat on the floor and simply lift your heels up and then lower them back down. As I said, you can do this while you're working, while you're watching TV or anything else. The best time to perform the exercise is after a meal or within an hour of finishing a meal with a lot of carbohydrate. So if you eat bread, pasta, rice or something sweet, remember to do 10 minutes of heel raises after the meal. It can significantly reduce the sugar spike now you might say why not just go for a walk or something they checked that in the study too and found evidence that activating the soleus muscle can be at least as effective as a 30 minute walk in reducing post meal sugar spike in certain situations this doesn't mean you should give up on activities like walking or running but rather use this exercise as an effective tool for controlling your blood sugar levels this exercise is especially great tool for people who sit a lot during the day. If you work in an office sitting in front of the computer for long hours, then this exercise is perfect for you. You can do it while you work, no one will notice, and it will help you feel better throughout the day. In conclusion, the soleus muscle is a powerful and effective tool for controlling blood sugar levels. 10 to 15 minutes of heel raises after a meal can make a significant difference. It's simple, it's effective, and it's something everyone can do. If this video helped you, I appreciate if you hit the like button so I will know it. Also, subscribe to the channel for more videos. Thank you for watching.